Hi friends! So today I have a bunch of multi-packs of minis. I've been waiting to open a whole bunch of these packs, so I figured why not just open a bunch of them in one video. So if you want to see all this stuff up close, let's get started! So if you guys want to know where I got any of this stuff in today's unboxing, I'll go ahead and do my best to try and link all the hauls in the description box below or in the iCards above because everything did come from different stores at different times. So we're going to go ahead and get started with this Nom Nom Stackable Silly Shake. There are four that you could have gotten, but it looks like I got rainbow slushy. I didn't really get it for any of the stuff that's inside. I just thought the container was really cute and something I could use to store some of my mini. So we'll go ahead and open this. All right, so she's all opened up. Go ahead and open this. So we have a pink spoon with a little bow, some ears, details on the back. We have an orange slice that looks like a bear. Really cute. And this one's like rubbery. I like that. And then here is our shake. Got a little straw, a little face, a little tail. I love it. Okay, so I went to wash these little guys off, and let me tell you, this, whatever it is, this slime, whatever it's made out of, was so impossible to get off these little figures. But we have this little bunny right here. It looks like a candy corn. Very cute. And then we have this little baby strawberry, and the little slime took off her eye, so I'll have to fix that. But this is very cute. Next, we're gonna go ahead and open this Lala Loopsies Tiny Bee Schoolhouse series number five. There are six packs to collect, and in each pack there's 10 little figures. And it says to also complete your collection, you need to buy the mystery button packs as well. So we'll go ahead and open this. Now we're gonna go ahead and open our real littles. This is my second um, 16 pack. So you get all the visible ones and then four hidden surprises. And like I said in my last unboxing, I really like these cause you can at least guarantee you'll like the ones up front, even if you don't like the ones that are hidden.
So just like the first pack, I got a bunch of them that I actually really like. Like I even love the mystery ones. I was expecting to be a little disappointed, but I absolutely love these. These are so cute. All of these little containers are going into Jimmy's little um, room and I, I just love it. I think not only did these just make it worth it because it's, it's good play accessories for any dolls, but if you don't mind the Shopkins, they're also great mini figures. Like I said, I'm just not a fan of the faces. So turning them around just as the figure doesn't really bother me. So that's really cute. And then the last thing I am going to be opening is this LOL Furniture Series 2. And it does tell you that you can unbox 10 surprises, furniture, accessories, a Series 3 doll grunge girl, and the fold-out playset, which is the box. So let's go ahead and open this. Look at her. Look how cute. She comes with little fishnet tights that are ripped. Her hair is so cute. Her little pink eyebrows. I love her. I love her skin tone. I love her eye color. All right, so we're going to go ahead and get her dressed and her little playset set up, and we'll be back. Bye, guys. All right, there she is. Look how cute. I was just trying to make sure that the back of her dress stays closed for her own modesty and for my peace of mind. I don't want to have a little baby doll that has her butt showing. Booty crack. Look at her. Oh my god, I love her. I love her. Oh my goodness. And from what I was seeing, she was tiny compared to the other ones that I have over here. Like, super tiny. I don't know if that's because she is a Series 3, which is way older than the ones that I have up here. But she is really tiny and lightweight compared to the ones that I have up here. So we'll go ahead and put her back there. And it actually looks like I did forget to open something. Oh, wow! Okay, so I was wondering how she was going to stand because she keeps falling over. And look how cool her stand is. It's a little stage. All right, so there's Grunge Girl all set up. I absolutely love her. I think she is so stinking cute. Absolutely adorable. I think she's one of my favorite LOLs to date. I just love this playset. I just think it is absolutely worth the money. You not only get the doll, but you get all the stuff that comes with her, the accessories, the cool stand. 
a place for her to play and then for you to fold it all back up and put it together that way it's nice and safe. I just absolutely love this. I think this might be my favorite thing that I opened today. So for you guys, what was your absolute favorite thing that I opened up today? Which one would you want and which one wouldn't you want? Let me know in the comments down below. If you like these type of videos, go ahead to comment, like, and subscribe. That way you can stay tuned for all the other stuff that I have to open for you guys. So thank you so much for coming back to another video. I hope to see you again in the future. Bye friends!